Anyways, good morning guys, that was an exciting morning already. We got random food. We got random food, we will see what we will end up eating from it. We are going on a private tour today here in Koron and we just... I'm trying not to get run over. We just stopped by at the market, got a lot of random things that they will hopefully make something nice for us later. There's so much interesting fish that I've never seen before, like huge weird fishes, that was so cool. Now we are waiting for our boat. We are going from boat to boat until we reach the last one. It's a challenge to get in. I'm in the out vagyunk. <laughs> we started all the way from the shore. <laughs> A boat bridge, boat to boat, walking here on the side, boat hopping tour. It was young, she carried Your boat. It's good. We arrived to the first stop, guys, Kayangan Lake, taking. How many stairs? Ah, 300 plus in total. 300 plus stairs. <laughs> oh yeah, so like 160 stairs up and then 150 down, something like that. Mom, check it, Kichi. No, me, I'm worth a massage. Yo, my girl. It was good. <laughs> Guys, we arrived to the Peak. We climbed up the 160 stairs and here's the famous viewpoint, the famous view of Corona, that's so beautiful. The cave. <laughs> there are even caves behind us. Uh -huh. Guys, we are at the lake now and it's so um, different than the last time we were here many years ago. A lot less people. It's early. it's early, we came at the perfect time. That's why I wanted it to be our first stop because I know it gets full quite fast. But literally just a few people now, that's so cool. On Instagram you can often see like pictures of this place where you barely see the view, just a lot of life jackets, but look at it now, it's so nice. <laughs> nice. I don't do that. <laughs> this is beautiful, guys. Sorry, I have like a cold voice, but snorkeling voice. But wow. Look at this, I can't believe it that I just look into the lake and the only person I see is Jonathan. Like, wow. <laughs> Excuse me. Good job! <laughs> I'm getting kidnapped! <laughs> Look at these guys! The Kayangan Lake in front of us and no one, just us! Oh, this is the most beautiful thing ever! Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> that's so bad. That's so bad. That's all my sexy job. Do you need it? We are the Natkayan Gale guys, we hike back. Oh, I see. I'm distracted because everything is so beautiful. I wanted to say that we hike back to the main port, but I already saw that there are so many like colorful fishes just right here at the port. beach now guys this is a beautiful um, like white sand beach the snorkeling spot and this beautiful tree is called what is it called I think it's Bakawan Bakawan guys we even found a path leading up somewhere at the trees here at CYC beach look how steep it is we always get our hike I'm going to climb it. go cool wow nice view you can see all over to the other side of the islands, that's so pretty. I'm sure we can eat that rice. I'm, I'm sure, no, that looks exactly like when you're lost in the jungle and you find a poisonous berry. <laughs> that's exactly something you shouldn't eat. What is this, guys? Maybe some of you know some poisonous looking jungle berries. <laughs> It was, it was a National Geographic show live. This was the most beautiful thing ever. So many types of fishes and interesting sea creatures and the grass. Like, like, like a screensaver. Yeah, it's like what you see in like those tropical screensavers. That was extremely beautiful. My dad said. Meanwhile, they are walking around enjoying the beach. My mom is a little bit sick, so she's um, chilling, not snorkeling, but they are enjoying the water now. But my dad said that there's more corals there so i think we should check it i need more of this this was so nice <laughs> let's go my book Jonathan Coron wow you never told me <laughs> CYC beach guys super recommended perfect beautiful white sand beach good for chilling and then the most amazing snorkeling spot also and mangrove trees it's 10 out of 10 <laughs> our next stop guys we are at the sunken shipwrecks which is from world war ii from the american japanese war there's actually in around Koron there are multiple um, sunken shipwrecks but this is one of the most um, like popular ones it's a japanese ship that is sunken somewhere in this area my dad is taking pictures of the view jonathan is getting convinced <laughs> While I'm blogging the view, there's some business going on. 
we will check out the sunken ship soon, but this is also going to be our lunch spot. They are already preparing the food for us. We are just enjoying the most beautiful turquoise water ever. Look at it everywhere I can. I, I, all my vlogs in Palawan is just wow. Look at it, guys. Wow. <laughs> but wow. <laughs> like this is the most clear water ever. Anido is also really beautiful. But in Anido, we had to go to like really specific places to be able to see this clear water. Like for example, in Big Lagoon. But here in Coron, it's just everywhere along the shore. Everywhere is this clear at random spots. My poor mom is sleeping. <laughs> she still feels sick. She's a little bit better, but when she's laying down, she's okay. If she's moving, she's starting to get like a um, sickness feeling. So she's just chilling. Well, I mean, if you have to be sick, this is a pretty nice view to be sick next to us. <laughs> but oh, poor her. This is guys our, well, not self-made, but self-made by the crew lunch just from the random ingredients we picked up at the market at the morning they made miracle look at this this huge tortang talong <laughs> i think this is probably the lunch with the best view we've ever had and we are topping up like beautiful places already around the philippines around palawan but i think we reached the peak view for a lunch most beautiful water ever. <laughs> Me and Nodj. Shrimp opening course. <laughs> I just learned recently also, before always Jonathan opens the shrimp for me, I grew up now and opened my own shrimp, even passing the knowledge to my dad. <laughs> oh, wait. A dog is swimming to us. That's the video, so it's not so good. Ah, look, it's Jonathan, Jonathan. Uh, George. Oh, wow. Hello. A monitor lizard. It's climbing up a monitor lizard. It was just chilling. So many things happened at the same time. We were just looking at this dog that it's swimming from the beach to our boat. Hello, I saw. It's climbing up the ladder. Oh, look, it can climb up the stairs. It will go here. Hello, you came for the food? Hi! Hello, Hi, Aso! Hello! Hello! You came? You're invited for lunch, you said? Hi. So, the dog arrived, and meanwhile, while I, I was going to video the dog, a mo huge monitor lizard was just chilling right there on the side. It just went up after I noticed it. That was so exciting! This place is truly the best. The dogs. Uh, interesting animals besides all the beautiful colors that was awesome wow it's not good food we have oh no your eye is injured you poor doggy a shrimp head look this is good oh yes now that our belly is extremely full it's a perfect time to get in the water and swim i will put back the gopro case we are actually using this that's why sometimes the view is pink when we are in the water because we are using this case just extra protection from the salt water and then this lens helps to give the real color of the things underwater so gonna put this on and then we check out the sun can ship break and I'm so excited to see it Oh, guys, we left the ship wreck. That was awesome. 
It's it's beautiful. Of course, it's interesting to look at the shipwreck, and there are a lot of fishes. But what's so cool about it is like how deep. Yes. Yeah. Very deep, and then you are just floating in the on the top of the big nothingness. It's so cool. <laughs> We left that and we came to the last stop of our day, which is Smith Beach. We were just looking for a place where we can chill a bit and look what we found. How isn't it the most beautiful like postcard view ever? <laughs> there even my mom is better, can't say no to this water. Yeah, <laughs> like the most clearest turquoise water and the whitest white sun. It's beautiful. So nice. Mami Ann. <laughs> this is so cool guys. There's even like caves uh, at the beach and there are so many fishes under. You don't even have to snorkel to see them. There are different schools of fishes starting from these very tiny ones. And like bigger ones here. Hello. And there's even like a whole like cave area to go through. That's so cool. Wow! This is why Koron is so popular, like it's totally worth the hype, like really you can just stop at any little white sand beach and the water will be like, <laughs> like something that you will only see usually in like documentaries or on postcards or wallpapers, like everywhere, like alongside the shore, it's so beautiful everywhere. <laughs> We've been eating a lot of like tourist food in the first day, so it will be so nice. Tourist doesn't go here. Tourist doesn't go here, but we do. We show my dad the good spots. Namian. Ah. It's like sticky rice, it's just uh, in like a wrapper, like a toron and also the sauce outside of it is like a toron. Love the vibes here, there's street food, and there's also a game going on, there's even pine tree, looks like Sagada. Anna, chill here and eat the, our street food and then relax. And that's exactly what we did, it was a perfect way to finish the day, but this is also going to be the end of this vlog, so thank you so much for watching, I hope you liked it, if you did then please leave a like and subscribe and we will see you next time in the next vlog, bye!